half a lot quicker than I thought. Cause yeah. I, th I mean, I've never heard of it really before, so I thought I should have a cast and all that. But exactly. once they put the rod in, that was it. I, wow. I had no nothing on it. So. So then, what what has been the rehab? Can you kind of walk me through the phases of the rehab? Oh, uh, well, at first we started with the, the uh, getting the range of motion, flexibility, getting all that back, and then. Uh, we also start work on the strength, um, and then PT. We've been going to PT, and we do a lot of the, a lot of the balance. A lot, everything's almost balanced. Uh, works with balance, strength, um, and then we're trying to kind of work on the nerve a little bit, strengthening that to bring my foot up. And kind of right now, I'm all tying it in together, so it's all coming in, coming together. What, where are the next steps beyond this? I mean, can you kind of walk me through? Have, have they given you a timetable? Uh, yet, not exactly. Not exactly. Because I said everyone's everyone's different, and um, they uh, basically said that. Or I want to get to walking perfectly normal. So my next step, I want because I still have a little bit of a limp, but I want to get there and then try to get to jogging and running as quick as I can. So uh, yeah, just yeah, it's just weird not to, <laughs> being able to. <laughs> You, you stole my next question. What's it like going out there knowing that in years past that was you in the helmet or in the yeah, and stuff? Yeah, uh, well, th I've never had a, never really had an injury where I've ever missed even a practice or anything like that. I've always never missed. And uh, I, since I've been playing hockey since I was five, I've always been out there. So um, it's definitely weird, mm -hmm. uh, especially not being able to run for over about six months going on. So yeah. that's definitely the weirdest part of it. So, yeah. What, what is your goal now? I mean, you, you talked about a short term getting your walk clean. Yeah. What's, uh, what's the long term? Long term goal. I wanted to. I want to play my senior year. That's the long term, because uh, a lot of them say the rehab will take a year, which put me in the middle of the season almost. So mm -hmm. my goal is to make it back. I want to make it back. That's what I've been from day one. So. And it seems to me like you talked a little bit about the pain early on, and and it. Can you just talk to me about the highs and lows of this? Uh, yeah, I'll tell you, it definitely uh, puts it in perspective to be able to, like people that are not, didn't, are not beneficial to have, be able to walk, right? I mean, it definitely, after being walking with a limp for going on six months, I mean, it's just, it's the most annoying thing. I, could, I mean, it's, it's just so frustrating because you want to be able to go, go somewhere and get somewhere fast and either have to drive or get a ride or it's just, even going to class, it put like just, I have a lot, I mean, yeah, for people like that in wheelchairs and stuff, I, I mean, I can't, I don't know how they do it, really. But, uh, yeah, it's uh, yeah, it's just hard. I mean, the pain, the, it's just, the pain's been the, probably the worst. It started, it was bad after surgery, but then uh, it's been getting better. But I still have it walking if I stand too long and stuff. So that's in the one, once that goes away, I feel like it'll be pretty good. What's your level of confidence in coming back? Are you confident that you can do this? Well, I'm always a confident person, so uh, I once I set my mind to something, I get, I, I get it done. That's what I basically what I pride myself on. So, yeah, I'll, I'll be out there. Great. Well, thank you.